Detroit Pro Football is back. And when I say football, of course, this time I'm talking about soccer, if you will, for you non footballers for DCFC. <laughs> uh, it's under new leadership football. this year, and uh, this season about to kick off tomorrow. First chance to see 2024's La Rouge at Keyworth Stadium. And your first chance to see Matt Sheldon, who just joined the Detroit City Football Club. Uh, this is exciting. You're coming off of a win in Colorado Springs and the home openers this weekend. Yes, yeah, it was a great win. I mean, that's how you want to start off the season is, is with yeah. three points. So really excited about that. And then now to be able to go to home and, and play in front of all the Northern Guard and the fans, it's going to be really exciting. Not that you could ever keep uh, DCFC fans away for any weather conditions, but just for the record, uh, it can't get cold enough or it can't get too cold and snow doesn't stop you either, correct? No, no. Play out there no matter what, unless you can barely see the ball because there's like three feet of snow, but <laughs> it should be on for tomorrow and just excited to get out there and hopefully get another win. Well, the good news is Ashley says the snow is going to melt pretty quickly. Um, you know, when you look at how this team did last season, what are you guys building off of? What do you what do you have for the fans this season? They added you, so that's a good thing. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> now Detroit, I mean, has always had a great team. They've had fantastic history, and Trevor James and, and everybody at the, the club has just great, built such a great organization. And now adding Danny Dicchio and all these new players coming in, I feel like we've just gotten stronger. So hopefully we can keep that momentum, keep going, and then – just have an even better season, make playoffs, and have a good playoff run this year. Nice. And you're a veteran who's been around this league. You've seen what it takes to win in this league. Uh, so it sounds like you're optimistic there. Uh, are you excited about being in Detroit? Now that you've played as a visitor, now you get that home cooking. Yeah. yeah I've, <laughs> I've said before that Detroit has the, the craziest fans in the league, the best atmosphere. Mm -hmm. uh, when you're going up against them, it's a little tough because you know, they're right in your ear. They're screaming at you. Ah. But hopefully having them on our side this time and my side is going to be way, way better. The fans are awesome. And also just Keyworth Stadium. Being in that stadium, like you said, it's just a special place. Yeah, definitely. I can't Do wait. Do they have anything new for the fan experience that you know about? Oh, they're always working on something. <laughs> <laughs> um, now, with uh, the team this year, uh, is there anything? I kind of talked about success, but when the team starts out like this, you've got a new, new coach. Do you put goals up on the wall? Do you talk openly about here's what we want to accomplish? Mm -hmm. Yeah, anytime a new coach comes in, there's always going to be a little bit of change. And uh, we're definitely working on different tactics a little bit. But still, I mean, Detroit's been a great team over the years. So we just really want to build on that yeah. and just add p bits and pieces here and there. So we've been working really hard day in, day out. I think the guys have pushed themselves every day this preseason and it's been going really well. well so there's so you. many folks that play soccer as kids. I know you were a star when you were 11. Yeah. <laughs> but how do you well. get to your level? You know, how do you get to do this for a living? What was your path? Honestly, just don't stop. That's yeah. the thing, kind of focusing on it. And it's just training every single day from five years old until you turn 31 years old and <laughs> nice. you got a wife and kid and still still training every single day. That's right, incredible. And the key is to have a leg that can kick the ball and the ball doesn't go straight. It goes <laughs> You like never this. quite figured that one it's out. It's a laser. No. <laughs> I'm still I working on that. I a game once and I was like, I don't even want to get near these guys. <laughs> right. <laughs> just get in the way of one of those things. Yeah. But, awesome. Uh, well, we want to yeah. make sure folks know how to find you guys so they can head out. And good luck this season. Thanks for stopping in. Yeah. The, by the way, the home opener tomorrow, 4 p.m. at uh, Keyword Stadium. That's in Hamtramck. You can get tickets at DetroitCityFC.com. Take advantage of that. And if it is a little too cold for you tomorrow, make sure you get out there at some point. The season's going to be fun. No, just get the hand and the body warmers and the boots. <laughs> you know, right. the things I, you I used agree. to wear in winter weather. <laughs> Thanks for coming in this way. Good to see you. Yeah. Appreciate it.